What's up guys, it's Emery and today we're going to be talking about a weird thing that happens in DaVinci Resolve. Sometimes if you bring in a piece of footage you'll realize that something is a little bit off. You know, there's like a little jump or hiccup in your video and you don't know why. We're gonna go over why exactly this happens and how to fix it. So I brought in my clip from artgrid.io today for us to experiment with. When I bring it into my timeline and play it back, you can see that there's somewhat of a little glitch or a hiccup, if you call it. Let me show you. Did you catch it? Let's watch one more time very closely. There. It's very slight, but if you are a perfectionist like me, you will definitely notice it and be wondering what's causing that. Before we do anything further, let's take a look at the metadata for this clip. You can go up here, click on metadata, and you will see the codec, the frame rate, and the resolution. The thing you need to pay attention to right now is this, 25 FPS. That means 25 frames per second. The most common frame rates I've seen in the US would be 23,976, which is for film, or 24, or 30, which is very popular on YouTube or with footage from a cell phone. So now that we know the frame rate, let's go take a look at our settings. We're going to go to File, Project Settings, and you see the problem? This is 23,976. So the frame rates don't match. That's why we're having that little hiccup. So there's two ways to deal with this. If all of your footage is the same frame rate, that's awesome and you can change your entire timeline to match that. So let's say we were doing a project that was all 25 frames per second. Then you would go here and switch to HD 1080 25. However, in some cases, you'll be working with mixed frame rates. So you might have something that's 23,976, you might have 30, you might have 60, you might have 25. So in that case, what do you do? So I'm going to quit out of this, leave the 23,976, and let's imagine that the project is all in 23,976. I'm bringing in this footage. This happens to be slow motion, this shot. Because it's slow motion, we can actually get away with changing the frame rate of this clip. And I'm going to show you how to do that. Right click. Clip attributes. And you change this to 23,976. And now, it plays back very smoothly. I'll tell you why this works in this situation, but it won't work in every situation. Because 25 is larger than 23,976, the frames can be slowed down to play back at that rate. But if you have shot something in 23,976 and you wanted to change that to 30 frames per second, it would not work because you will not have enough frames to fill that amount of time. So I hope this was helpful for you guys. I'm sure you're going to run into this problem at some point. So now you should know what to do with it. And if you have any further questions, comment down below. Give us a like, subscribe. I'm out here giving all this post-production content. So I really appreciate you watching these videos and I'm happy to help. 